Let's move to the latest search strategy in locating the missing passengers from the Sewol Ho ferry. Operations are focusing, like Myungil said, on the third and fourth floors. This is where experts believe most of the bodies will be found. For details, let's turn to our Kim Hyun Bin, who's standing by the Central Disaster and Safety Headquarters on Jindo Island. Hyun Bin. Uh, hey Mark, a uh, spokesperson here said Tuesday uh, that search teams have recovered over 60 bodies uh, from the third and fourth floor of the vessel over the past 48 hours. Now, most of the victims retreat over the past two days were high school students who were in the ferry's lounge when the vessel capsized. Uh, he added that many more unrecovered bodies are thought to be located in the cafeteria of the vessel as it was breakfast time when the ferry started listing. Uh, that area is going to be the next place divers enter. The spokesperson admitted that they are facing some difficulties since divers need to knock down a wall and even before that, that they need to remove all the waste and debris that is blocking their access to the area. Another briefing is scheduled for later this morning with details on yesterday's search operations as well as today's schedule. I'll bring you those details in our later newscast. Until then, this has been Kim Hyun-bin reporting live at Central Disaster and Safety Countermeasures Headquarters in Chindo.